Hey everyone, welcome back to another The Maurice Plays Let's Play. Pascal is here. We are of course playing Animal Crossing Let's Go to the City or Animal Crossing City Folk and our trees are growing which reminds me you should probably check if our trees have grown here and they didn't. What is this? We've got like a dead tile or a dead line. Not one of these trees has grown. That sucks. <laughs> I'm not sure what I think about this. This is this area is okay, but this area, we might have to rethink this. But anyway, we're on the clock because we are checking AM turnip prices. So um, we're going to go ahead and get those first because we have like 400,000 or 300,000, 400,000 worth of turnips to sell. Um, and the turnip prices in the other town, the spare we are not great. So. Let's go for the Tuesday. One time sells for 67. It's going lower and lower. Oh dear. So we've gone 73 a.m. Monday, 70 p.m. Monday, and 67. Oh, that is not looking good. Uh, right, have we got any stuff in here that we need to get rid of? Oh, we've just got one thing, which I believe is a Mario item, which we don't really need. So we'll get rid of that. Um, so we might end up flicking over to Wednesday as well to catch up because we are a day behind anyway. Um, and if the turnip price are going to keep lowering, I kind of want to get through them pretty quickly. So we'll, maybe we'll see what um, is in store for tomorrow. What do we got here? Ooh, kitty wardrobe. Got the blue clock. Do we have this cabin clock? We've got the cabana vanity. Um, of course, we won't swap over until we we have done with Pascal. Because uh, we are looking for one more Pascal item as well. Anyway, we're looking for the cabin. Is it the cabin clock? I believe. Um, Okay, cabin clock. Okay, we do have it. And then we'll just check the kitty wardrobe. Kitty, oh no. Dresser. Oh, so we do need the kitty wardrobe. So we've got the dresser, couch, chair table, stereo. So we need this, we do need this. <laughs> There we go. Uh, I wish it was a bit easier to remember what we had other than checking the catalog. I feel like it should have like a, a new, little, like one of these, but in front of it just like a tiny one that says new. And then that way we'll know if we've not catalogued it. Because I'm lazy. I don't want to check the catalog each time. Right, well, the bears will go for the carpets. We're pretty good at remembering the carpets. Backyard lawn, we'll take that. Uh, Cowhide rug, no thank you. Oh, I thought it was the other one that we pressed. Uh, we've got a few minutes to kill anyway until the PM prices. Checkerboard, yeah, I think we've pretty much got all of the carpets now. Apart from the elusive exotic rug, which I'm starting to think doesn't exist in this game. Uh, let me see, is this the library wall? I think we have that. Stately wall. A bit expensive. Timmy and Tommy, what are you trying to pull? Cityscape, we've definitely got that because it's really cool. Reminds me of like an apartment on the top, you know, like a loft or what do they call them? Um, I can't remember. You know where you have the apartment on the very top of the building, it's like the highest one you can get to. They're normally the most expensive in like cities and stuff. That wallpaper always reminds me of that. Uh, I feel like it's quite an exclusive wallpaper. Oh, actually, we could probably sell the backyard lawn back again. Get all these flowers. Uh, really, we're just kind of checking tenant prices today. Uh, it's a shame about the trees. I just don't know what to do there. Maybe we've reached our maximum tree limit. We'll go and get a island rating. Although the only problem is we've got turnips laying everywhere. So they're just going to say, tidy up. <laughs> um, let's uh, get rid of this lawn. 
Oh no, it's a kitty wardrobe. Um, did we buy it? I thought we bought the lawn, didn't we? There it is. Gotta open my eyes. Okay, let's get back outside. Oh, that's so disappointing that uh, the whole row there, that means, well, it was the three in between plus the three we buried, not a single one is growing. It's a little bit annoying. I don't know what to do here, honestly. I feel like we might have to move them over one tile to here and here and here and then here and then here let's go and get a town rating just on the off chance walker hey i was waiting for you to come outside and play mori a day without something going on in mori land is kind of like a superhero without a cape mori land is like a town without sunshine at the moment i mean sure it's okay but just like everyone loves a flashy cape everyone also loves to party you're not wrong uh, oops. Right, let's lay some flowers here because this bit's getting a little bit out of control. They never go where you want them to. We're also going to go and put some down by the alien glyphs. Because that's also getting a little bit out of hand. Here. This area is almost back to full health, but we're going to move them the flowers here for the moment, I think. Try and get this area looking a little bit nicer. Uh, Today is Apollo's birthday. Go congratulate him on another trip around the sun. Oh. I still don't know how villager birthdays work in this game. I don't think there's anything we can do. Knock, knock, Apollo, are you home? It's noon, so we can't stay for long, so we need to go and check the turnip prices. Um, hey, oh no, big fossil in your house. <laughs> Happy birthday. Well, I'll be Pookie, aren't you brave walking right into the lion's den? We just come to wish you um a happy birthday. Uh, you know, a lot of folks have told me this room doesn't really suit my personality, but you know, uh, better, right? You see how it fits me, don't you? Don't you? Uh, yes. Did you get that fossil for your birthday? Because it, yeah, it doesn't go. I'm not going to lie. <laughs> I think people are onto something. Okay, let's go and get the turnip prices. There's just no point in getting an island evaluation yet, actually. A fruit tree limit is there we're not trying to plant too many pear trees or something that would be awkward um guess who's back we need uh turnip prices the pm tuesday turnip prices are 62 ouch they are still dropping the good news is i don't think they're going to drop too much more Oh no, apparently the pattern is constantly decreasing. So it could, but how can it keep decreasing? Even if it decreased by one, it could drop, oh, I suppose it could drop down to 54 by PM on Saturday. Ooh. Okay, let's go deal with Pascal because we are waiting for one more item from him. I think it's the anchor. We've got all of the others. We have had some duplicates from Pascal. Um, I believe we have a thing in our storage oh, we better not forget to water this I wonder if Pascal comes back for Mary um because he swims off does he come back if you boot up another player I'm not sure Okay, so I'm hoping we've got one left. There we go. A nice scallop. As soon as we sell the turnip prices, we will be able to buy another Gracie item. I think this is the last few weeks we can get them anyway. Um, but they do eventually go on sale at some point as well. Hey, Pascal. Give us some good news because we have some bad news from Nook. 
Oh man, Stanley is so tiring. Hey, can I share a little something with you? Sure. Uh, friends are like the suckers on a tentacle. Man, you can't get by without them. Right on. <laughs> hey, hook an otter up with a scallop, would you? Uh, sure. There you go. Uh, look, man, this here, I'm giving it to you. What is it? Tell me what it is. Wait a sec. An anchor! Yay! That's, I believe, is the last item we need. So, we're going to go and drop this outside Mary's house. Don't even try to buy the anchor, Freckles. Oh no, word on the streets that you have an anchor. Yeah, this is. This, I'm, I'm gonna stop you right there, Freckles. This just, this just isn't happening. Especially for an iris chair. Um, no. Oh well, I'm sorry. Oh no. Oh, at least, at least they're not angry about it. Um, right, we're gonna drop the anchor by Mary's house. We're gonna grab the money rock, and then we're gonna catch up to the morrow, so we can get the. Wednesday and today's days turnip prices. Uh, I thought I saw a star here somewhere. Where was it? Where was it? I definitely saw. Oh, there it is. Okay, we're gonna grab the money rock. Pascal's probably coming past any. But there he is. <laughs> Enjoy your the rest of your day, Pascal. At least this tree grew, so we don't have to dig a hole. Ah, oh, we've got some more apples back, at least. Um, right, we're just going around to check. I think I just heard a balloon as well. We're just going around to check the money rocks what's this heading I was wondering if we could get it to drop in a cool place but I don't think we can oh, have we got more no there's a pear tree that died here Hope it's not this one. I'm trying to let the grass heal here. Have you no consideration? Oh yes, look, we've got another um, carnation has spawned. Nice. I don't want to have to lose on the turnips. It's a bit harsh that there's even a pattern that constantly decreases. We don't want to lose like 200,000 bells is what we would lose. If it got down to like 54, which I think is probably the lowest. chair oh handy um okay then we'll uh oh we don't need to check if anyone's here because we've already seen pascal in that case we'll time travel to tomorrow to get the am prices for wednesday okay it's now wednesday am again so we're fast forwarding a little bit um as you can see the pl the flowers are back um, I'm expecting this now, if it is the decreasing pattern, it's going to be like 60 or lower. 58! Ouch! We can't seriously be having this bad luck. 
with trees and with turnips. Tom, look, what are you doing to us? This is unbelievable. You may as well buy the flowers, even though you don't deserve the money. This is how this is how Tom Nook makes his money back. He gives you a low turnip price, and then he goes and sells them to somewhere for higher. We figured him out. This is where he gets all his money from. We're on to you, Tom. If that is your real name. <laughs> But yeah, if you have any ideas what to do with the trees, please let me know. I think once they've grown pears, we're going to have to harvest the pears and dig them all up again. And try something different. We'll be back in five minutes, Tom Nook, for the PM prize. Please, let them start peaking. I guess there's still a chance that it will eventually rise again. Because from 58, how much lower can it go? There's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven more prices to check before Saturday. Um, surely it can't keep going down into the 40s each time because it would go 56, 54, 52, 50, 48, 46, 44. We could get to the lowest price um, ever. Right, we've got a whole bunch of apples, so pretty happy with that. Um, I think we're just gonna have to harvest the pears and do something with them. Right, let's go and put some more down by the thing. We'll put one here actually, trying to heal the grass as much as possible. Uh, we just did, oh a ninja sword in our showroom in Nookingtons. I don't know if we've had the ninja sword. I feel like if we have had it, we definitely would have bought it, depending on how much it was. Um, do this bit as well. Okay, Gaston, how are you doing? Why is it still cloudy and grey when it's supposed to be the height of summer and the rainy season's ended? What's going on? Now that we've got a bus line, we can get to the city easier. I've seen a, a lot fewer of them. But this town still has the need for occasional traveling salesmen. A carpet salesman here turns out that they're a nomadic musician. is nice once in a while. It's just nice to, get, uh, to talk to someone who's got a fresh batch of stories from the outside world. You can go travel into the city, you know, Gaston. You don't have to stay here. As long as you come back, though. We, we kind of like you. Right, so... Let's go and see what we can do while we're waiting for noon. Let's go and see what we can do about these pear trees. I can't leave them like it is because it's just messy. It goes against kind of what we're trying to achieve. So, it's, ooh, it's almost pointless having it there, so we might as well get rid of it. Uh, we can always move them somewhere else. I'm sure somewhere else would grow a slightly better thing. Oh, before we start this, let's check out Walker's house. Because um, it's always nice to check a new villager's home. So we'll check out what Walker's house looks like inside. Hopefully it's cool. Oh, it's a bit empty in here, but you've got some... We've got some rare fish in here. Are you a keen fisher? This is this is not good for a, a flea market walker, I'm not gonna lie. Are you here to hang out, Maury? Well, you've come to the right place. Fine, we'll, we'll just sit here and hang out. <laughs> the noise. I can't tell if it's supposed to be the rude sound effect or if it's like supposed to be like when you get leather on leather or you know like leather chairs squeak <laughs> I catch one I catch uh, I catch one I won't I catch one I won't I'll catch one I won't I'll catch one according to my bug fortune I'm gonna catch a honeybee today wait where do you get your bug fortune from wait is that what kind of goldfish is that it's not a goldfish oh well nice house it's a little bit sparse but 
you know, I, I like the minimal look, so I'm not going to judge. Hello. <laughs> okay, so... Okay, let's just... We'll leave this row of trees here for now. As a backup, because we know they grow. Um, so we're going to have to try and move these along one. I think. Let's just pick up some flowers. No. So, oh, a fire bar and a blue chair. We don't really need those, do we? Um, right, we're looking for our axe. get rid of these trees and just try something we know where they'll grow now so we can revert back to this it'll just take a few days um, I'm sure there's a factor it's unusual for a whole line to not grow any trees so I can only assume Maybe it's the edge of an acre or something, or... I don't know. It's a shame, but we're going to have to get rid of the path. Um, just as a test. And then we'll go and check the PM prices. So we're going to have to try here. There. Like this. So if we move them over a tile, uh, we could always bring the path down this edge if we wanted to. Um, if this works, I'd be happy to have like a double orchard where they the, they merge and then have the path on the outer edge. Um, right, let's start planting some pears. Oopsie, forgot to put a pear in. just gonna finish this off this square here I don't even know if we're gonna plant the middle one actually because uh, we could get away with not having it uh, kind of like how we don't have a middle one here so I feel like if we don't plant it it might encourage the others to plant because I do I know in, in future games it is, it is tricky to get a grid of trees, but in earlier games it's not, so we might end up bringing the path down this side. It's just a shame about the weirdness. I was really hoping for a nice grid just for that. I won't keep talking about it, you, you know what the plan was by now. Um, if they don't grow, we'll move the path back, and we know which ones work now, so some of them work, but this line doesn't. And we'll, we'll see if these grow tomorrow, I guess. I think what I'll do is leave a bunch of fruit here in case we end up having to um, try again tomorrow. Because if they don't sprout tomorrow, then we can put them back, hopefully. 
Right, let's go and get the PM price. There was another beetle on there. I think that was a different beetle, wasn't it? Didn't realize there was different kinds of beetles, or maybe it just looked different. I don't know. Uh, right. Last was 58. 54. How are they dropping this low? We are not having good luck. We're only halfway through. We've had six readings. Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, AM and PM. And we've still got Thursday, Friday, Saturday. So they they must, it must start going up tomorrow. Otherwise, that's just dropped four. So if it drops four again, it'll be 50 tomorrow. Then 46, then 42, then 38, then 34, then 30. Surely it doesn't go that low. Nook, what are you doing to me? <laughs> Oh, okay, we better have a run around just to make sure there's not a traveler here. We wouldn't want to miss Wendell or someone like that. But, yes. It's a little bit annoying. Uh, we could get the money rock, actually. We need to, Seems like we might need to be starting to make more money again. Oh, we found it. Any doubles? No doubles. It's good when we find the rock straight away because it means we don't walk on the grass around the other rocks and it gives them a chance to heal for an extra day. 8,100. Oops. We'll take it. My other hand, my nunchuck hand, always gets in the way of my Wii remote and the sensor underneath my monitor for some reason. Um, I'm going to water these carnations because they are breeding, which is really awesome. Maybe we could have a, a town just full of carnations eventually. That'd be kind of cool. I wonder if anyone's ever done that. Just, just gone with one type of flower. Which flower would you choose? Carnations would be a good one because I feel like they're kind of a limited, exclusive uh, flower, aren't they? Oh, we forgot to buy the ninja sword. Um, oh no, that was today, wasn't it? Um, hooray, it's finally here. 8th of the July is the point special day when you earn five times the points. Okay, we've definitely got to go shopping then. Right, we're just going to get a town rating. I think Pelly's just going to say something about the turnips lying around. Um, but we could move them into our storage. But then there's kind of no point. Uh, this is the window for the civic center. What can I help you with? Um, the environment. All right, then let me read you some of the comments. I'm not sure what good will do to write this, but could you try and be a bit more thoughtful about the town? Because at this rate, oh, that's the report. It sounds like the problem is there's too much stuff on the ground. Yes, we kind of figured that would be the issue. Uh, oh, we have a coconut palm. We'll steal that. I think I'm going to deposit some money in the bank as well. Uh, we'll just put 50,000 away. Try and make a little bit of interest. Seems we're relying on a decreasing turnip pattern now. I don't think I've ever seen it go as low as the 30s and 40s, but we could see that this week, I think. Okay, we'll just run along the beach, make sure we're not... Uh, what was that? Got excited then because I thought it was Gulliver. I thought I heard a beep. Oh well, must be hearing things. I don't think we'll ever encounter Gulliver, by the way. Let's uh, have a bit of a run round. All of our fruit trees should have grown back. Yeah, so we can make some more orchards. This place here would, might be a good place for an orchard. But maybe it doesn't pay to try and be like even and symmetrical. <laughs> yeah, I don't think anyone's in town today. Uh, 
Well, sorry about that. That's a bit. I feel like it's a bit of a disappointing episode when we have bad luck. No trees. No good turnip prices. And no visitor by the looks. Uh, Pookie, have you ever found that no matter how many of you own one thing, keep buying more? Yeah, Animal Crossing games. <laughs> and Animal Crossing cards. Uh, for me, whenever I see a stately wall, I can't help breaking out my wallet. So can you imagine? Uh, so I can interest you in... What? No way. It's literally for sale in Nooks. For like 2,000. Nice try, Apollo. Better luck next time. I'm gonna check behind our house for a fossil. No, no fossils, but that there should be a golden shovel now. Okay, I think that's all we really need to do. And hope that these grow tomorrow. I'll shake these down. Get the feeling we're going to have to make our money back. <laughs> um. There we go. I won't shake these ones down because I don't want anything too close to these trees to affect the potential growth of these trees. Um, but yeah, we can always extend our path along here and then down, I think. Um, but there we go. That's pretty much all we need to do today, I believe. Um, just sorry that it was a little bit of a downer. There's not many good turnip prices and not good news about the trees. So hopefully tomorrow we have better luck. At least we got the anchor of Pascal. So we have now completed the Pascal furniture. So maybe Mary can pay off her mortgage and get the Pascal items out on display upstairs. I think that would be something cool to do as well. Um, hopefully tomorrow we can get back on track with things and either do our path or or Mary's mortgage one of the two let me know which one you'd like to see the most a new path or try and grind for Mary's mortgage so we can get the Pascal items out on display so I hope you enjoyed it anyway despite the uh, sort of down news the negative news um, hopefully things will pick up I can't see the turnip prices going down to 30 so they've got to pick up tomorrow um, but yeah thanks so much for watching um, I hope you enjoyed it. Thank you, of course, to channel members. I'll see you all in the next one tomorrow. Bye!